Okay, guys. Well, this is for the few people that care. I put in the new foot switch for low beam. That's low beam. That's high beams. The old switch, as you can see, right there, was all corroded. And definitely seeing its uh, fair share of use. So now I just got to tighten the screws for the, like I said, the foot switch. It's going to take me a few minutes. I don't think I can pause on this, which is a pain in the butt. My old phone, you could, uh, pause for switching the video. So, all I gotta do now is like so. Go here. Tighten that down. Put this foam back over it. that back up and now all I gotta do is get this side cover slide it back in as I activate the turn signal stock it's above my head and very carefully Try to reinsert the trim panel behind the bezel to the door. Okay, guys. Well, I put in the new foot switch for the low beams and high beams. This is what was in there. As you can tell, it was. It probably could have worked again if I would have cleaned it up. But now <clears throat> I can, you'll kind of see through a windshield. Low beam, high beams. And <clears throat> I had some video of the installation I might include. That was a pain. Now, see, it's <clears throat> the thing. Neither high beam works on the passenger side. But if I go click it back down, now I have both low beams are still not bad.